Schubert's song Die Forelle, or The Trout, was composed in 1817. And I'm going to read a brief translation of the three stanzas of the poem that Schubert sent to music. A playful trout, and here we actually have a picture of a playful trout that we were able to obtain from a, a generous local collector. Um, uh, well, it came from the second floor man's room. <laughs> but we, uh, we, we just we borrowed it because it, it's a picture of a playful trout, and that's what this song is about. So, um, the playful trout darted about happily in a clear brook. I stood on the bank and happily watched the merry fish bathe. A cold-blooded fisherman stood on the bank with his rod, watching the fish wriggle about. So long as the water remains clear, I thought, he will not catch the fish. But suddenly, the thief got tired of waiting. He slyly muddied the brook, and before I realized it, he jerked the rod, and the fish struggled on the line. And I, with raging blood, watched the betrayed one. Uh, the Schubert song, uh, this song was immensely popular and published several times during his lifetime. Two years after the first publication, a wealthy patron asked Schubert to compose a quintet for the specific instruments of piano, violin, viola, cello, and bass, and to use the, trout, the tune from the Trout song in some way in the, in the, uh, in the piece. So Schubert made um, the song into the theme of the theme and variations movement of the quintet, the fourth movement. And, um, and you will hear that some of the uh, movements feature uh, one instrument or another instrument in a more prominent role. But the, but the, the song, the, 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 the tune of the song is, is in everything. Um, so uh, after I sing the song, we're going to perform the theme and variations movement from the Trout Quintet. And then we're going to conclude the concert with the brief and very uh, bright um, scherzo and trio movement from the Trout Quintet.